Thanks for checking out Magic Monday, episode one. It is gonna be a great run, really happy to do it. Very excited where it's going. So today we're gonna to check out the Spectre, number one, not the first appearance, but this is the first solo uh, title. Uh, and this came out in December of 1967. And it starts off with a, an ambassador of some kind, and he is headed to Switzerland and he's gonna sign a treaty that's going to prevent World War III. They don't call it World War III in the story, but for this case, I'm going to refer to it as World War III. So on his way to the limo, before he gets there, he is actually shot by some kind of assassin. He gets rushed to the hospital. The doctors do what they can to try and save him, but out of nowhere, he gets off the operating table, runs down the street, robs a costume shop to dress like a pirate and gets in a car, drives off. He's chased by none other than Jim Corrigan, AKA the Spectre, uh, in a police chase. Uh, and they make it to a park where there is a really big statue and Jim Corrigan gets knocked out. This pirate possessed person who at this point is obvious, it's not the same person, he's being possessed by something, is gonna kill Jim Corrigan by slamming this statue on him, but he's intervened by the Spectre. This possessed person uh, and the Spectre do have a battle, they duke it out, but for some reason, the Spectre just cannot get the best of this guy. So, they travel through time to different periods in in the, the, this possessed person's life. Uh, and it is depicted on the cover very well. As you can see, it, he is a pirate. He is some kind of knight. He looks like he's a, a Roman soldier. And they're all fighting the Spectre. So they travel to different periods in humanity and the different events that are important to humanity. And they continue the fight. The Spectre realizes he can't beat him for whatever reason. Uh, in time, so he decides to go into purgatory, so to speak, uh, find the ghost of this possessed person and essentially punch the ghost. Uh, and that's exactly what happens. The ambassador is brought back to the hospital, makes a full recovery, cut to Jim Corrigan's apartment. You see the ambassador did make it to Switzerland. He did make it to the uh, signing of the treaty in time to prevent World War III. Uh, and that's the end of this story. Nice and quick, nice and short. Thought it would be a great uh, introductory episode. But um, yeah, stay tuned for more on Magic Monday. Uh, but don't forget to check out some of the other content on this channel. Uh, we have uh, Magic Lasso with Wonderful Wednesdays. We have Tim, the comic collector, who puts out Tales from the Green Lantern Corps. Um, on this channel as well um, and we also do the fanboys and retro review on a rotating basis and i'll put the links to those channels down in the below in the description um, as uh, one thing i also want to mention i'll put a tag somewhere over somewhere over here there's a tag link to my channel where i'm actually going to do a deep dive and we're going to look at the pages of this book look at some of the ads look at some of the letters that uh DC, people that bet uh, us as the fans got to write in the DC and publish in, in books like this. Uh, something I enjoy doing. Uh, and let's go and take a look. So, thanks for checking me out. We'll see you next week.